Hey everybody, my name is Alicia and today I'm going to review the Lug Life Puddle Jumper Backpack in two different colors, brushed black and brushed walnut. So here they are. Here is the brushed black. For those of you that like to stick to black, since black can go with a lot of different things. And here is the brushed walnut. Now, when I saw this backpack, I knew I wanted it for a long time. And when I wanted to replace my son's diaper bag backpack, and it just sits in the car, really. And I'm reaching a point where I was looking for basically items where it could serve two purposes. The times that we do run errands and the weekends that I do have him. Um, but something that could also be for me and my stuff. So I decided to go online and look for, you know, more of a backpack or a tote. But when I came across Lug Life products, um, I did previously purchase a Lug Trolley. And I'm in love with it. That was my very first Lug product. So I decided to go through Lug products because I was so impressed by the quality of the trolley. And when I heard they had a backpack, or actually they have several backpacks, but when I heard they had a full-size backpack, um, I was interested in that one because this could also be used for when I'm traveling or if I go hiking. I mean, this thing is huge, so it's great to fit a lot of different things. So in any event, I started looking at Lug Life backpacks and I fell in love with the Puddle Jumpers. Specifically, I'll show you on this on the lighter colored one because it's probably a little bit easier, but I fell in love with specifically these three uh, zipper pouches and of course that's when I discovered that they have this you know this uh, cell phone pocket which by the way is genius and they if they could patent that which would be nearly impossible um, since so many purses come with a zipper pouch of some sort or some sort of open pouch um, but if they could if lug life could patent the magnetic closure holy cow they could make so much money with how many other bag you know bag brands that are out there because this is such an amazing feature you feel like it's closing so you feel like your phone is secure in the event that your bag just kind of topples over but it's also accessible it's not a zipper so you're getting the best of both worlds lug think about it patent magnetic closure a lot of money for you guys. Anyways, I fell in love with the fact that it had these pockets on the outside. And of course, what I did was I actually, I didn't know what color I wanted and I was really interested in the brushed walnut, which is, I saw a bunch of QVC videos and I ordered the brushed walnut because I felt like that was a really good minimalist neutral color. But when I got it, I will admit it appears a lot darker and if you're looking at this bag in not so good lighting, you're gonna think it looks more like an olive green. So um, yes, I wanted to do this review because I specifically wanted to tell people that the brushed walnut on QVC and in their Lug Life videos on YouTube look a lot lighter than they do in person. So I just want you to be wary of that. Um, with that being said, if Lug Life is watching this, I wish you guys could make something. I, I think you guys do have a taupe color. I think I would love this backpack in the taupe. I'm a little bit more of a minimalist, and of course, I'm trying to just stay with neutral colors. Just so I know that these things can be timeless, especially if I just keep them for like 10, 20 years. Um, but in any event, this is what the Lug Life backpack looks like. And I went ahead and ordered the black because, again, I'm always falling on black. Black goes with everything. I'm going to end up sticking with the black. It's just timeless. Plus, um, it's not going to get as dirty, even though you have this. In case it gets a little dirty on the outside, you're not really going to notice it. All right, guys, I'm going to show you a little bit more of a close-up of the brushed black Puddle Jumper Backpack by Lug Life. You've got this big zipper on the bottom and it zips all the way down so you can open 
almost completely. But the cool thing is you've got these guards that'll keep your stuff from just falling out. Okay, so you're gonna have a little pocket in the front. Um, and then this actually comes with a clear pouch, which of course you can put anywhere in the backpack. And this one has two fleece lined pockets for, you know, anything that is like for me, it'd be my iPhone or my sunglasses and my Apple watch. I don't have a scratch protector on my Apple watch. Sometimes I think the screen protectors can kind of dull the look of your phone. So I don't like to put it on there, but at least I know it's protected if I need to take it off. And then, of course, the other two awesome things about this bag is you've got the two big pockets at the front. These are pretty small, but I will tell you this, I fit my business card holder in these. Um, so it's a little thin holder that fits several business cards, or you can slide this right in and put some business cards in there. Here, I like to put my uh, chapstick, something, since it's very tiny, uh, I'm gonna put those tiny things in my front pocket. And these are open magnetic closures cool thing about these two pockets is this is where I actually put um, like on one side I'll put my Apple AirPods and I'll put the Rode microphone I put those on one side the other side I fit my keys because my keys are kind of bulky and I need to know that I'm not digging through anything the other cool feature is if you put these two zippers closed together you can actually fit a lock an anti-theft lock either on that side or the circular part then you have this magnetic closure huge pouch if you can see my arm okay it goes pretty much all the way down to the edge of the bag but it comes up here to my hand so this you can fit a huge spiral notebook your iPad you can even fit a laptop like if it's a smaller laptop you can definitely fit a laptop in this front and then of course you have the magnetic closure uh, phone pocket and again it goes up to here if you want to see how big that would be that fits a pretty big phone pretty big pretty long phone then Here's what the inside lining looks like. You have a little zipper pocket here. You have two pouches here. What I love about these pouches is that they remind me of, you know, they remind me of a diaper bag. So if I wanted to put diapers here, bottle here, or diapers here and wipes here, or diapers and wipes and snacks, whatever, I can totally keep it separate from my own stuff. You have another huge internal pocket that goes all the way to the opening of the bag. And then just to try to see if I can give you an idea of how wide the bag is. I mean, it's as wide as what you see here. I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty wide. You get a lot of space. And then you have a third opening. Again, you have the anti-theft uh, option on there if you want to put a lock. This is where you would ideally keep your laptop because it's got the extra padding and it's completely separate. And this is actually pretty wide, so um, you might be able to fit two like MacBook Airs in there because MacBook Airs and MacBook, uh, even some of the MacBook Pros are pretty thin now. So if you needed to fit two people's items, I think you could do it. Of course, you've got the water bottle holder, which by the way, does hold my larger water bottles. And you've got another one here. That way, if you have a kid, uh, I always have my water bottle and then I have his sippy cup and they do fit those little chunky sippy cups also, so that's great. And I like that, you know, even though they expand out, they kind of retract back in, so they're, they just don't sit open. I guess unless you just wore this thing out so much, and then again, just to show you the back, you do have the little um, sleeve that where you could just put this over your rolling luggage and there is just a little dot right there to keep it connected. The pad or the, the straps on the backpack pads are really soft, but they're padded. So it feels really good. This is, I've seen some of these hiking backpacks that are costing hundreds of dollars this one, I only paid 108 for on Amazon, 
and it's one of her newer colors, the brushed black. So this to me, especially if you're looking at this as hiking bag and or you're a college student or even a high school student and you're, you know, you pretty much have your backpack on you 24 seven, um, especially when you're walking to class and whatnot, this would make a great bag. And I really think it'll take a lot to really wear this thing out and uh, you're not spending a few hundred dollars for it. So hope that you liked my review. If you want to see more reviews on Lug Life products, just subscribe to my channel because there's a lot more coming out as I have purchased more than just two Lug Life products by now.